Hi, welcome to Mathematics. In this video, I want to simplify 25 divided by 4 is to the power 9 over 4. Let's see the solution. We have 25 divided by 4 is to the power 9 divided by 4. So let's say our method 1. From here, we can express 25 as 5 raised to the power 2 and uh, 4 as 2 raised to the power 2. So we we'll have 5 raised to the power 2 divided by, then 4 will be 2 raised to the power 2. Raised to the power 9 divided by 4. So from here, you know, when we have a raised to the power 2 divided by b raised to the power 2, this equals a divided by b square. So by applying this to the above expression, we will have we we'll have five divided by two, then square. Then we have it gets to power nine divided by four before. So we have it like this. So from here we will have 5, one number which is raised to a certain power is again raised to another power. The powers are multiplied. So we will have 5 divided by 2 square multiplied by 9 divided by 4. You see, we can have one, 2 here, 1, and 2 here will be 2. So we have 5 divided by 2 raised to the power 9 divided by 2. From here, we can express 9 as the sum of 8 and 1. Let's see. We have 5 divided by 2 raised to the power 8 plus 1 divided by 2. We know 8 plus 1 will give us 9. So now we will have 5 divided by 2. Then we have 8 divided by 2 plus 1 divided by 2. From here, we'll say 2 here, 1, and 2, we have 4. So we will have 5 divided by 2 raised to the power 4 plus 1 divided by 2. But remember from the law of indices that when we have x raised to the power m times x raised to the power n, this is equals x is to the power m plus n. So when number which has the same base have been multiplied, their power are added from the law of indices. So by applying this, we will have we have this. We have five divided by two raised to the power four times five divided by two raised to the power one over two. So that means that you distribute the power. So then, now we will have here 5 raised to the power 4 divided by 2 raised to the power 4. Multiply by 5 divided by 2 raised to the power 1 over 2. You know, 5 raised to the power 4 will give us 625. And 2 raised to the power 4 will give us 16. So, and here we will have 1 over 2, power of 1 over 2, give, it means we have square roots, then we have 5 divided by 2. If we distribute this square root, we will have 6 to 5 divided by 16, multiplied by square root of 5, divided by square root of 2. So, from here, if we multiply this, we will have 6 to 5 times square root of 5, we have 6 to 5 square root of 5 divided by 16 times square root of 2, we have 16 square root of 2. So from here, by rationalizing the denominator, we have 6 to 5 
divided by 16 root 2. If we rationalize, we are going to multiply both numerator and denominator by square root of 2. We have multiply by square root of 2, then square root of 2. Multiply this and this, we will have. Okay, sorry, we have square root of 5 here. So we have 6 to 5. 6 to 5. Multiply by square root of 5 times 2. Divided by 16. Then multiply by square root of 2 times 2. From here we'll have 6 to 5. 6 to 5. Multiply by square root of 10 divided by 16 times square root of 4 so we we'll have 6 to 5 square root of 10 divided by 16 and square root of 4 will give us 2 so we we'll have 6 to 5 square root of 10 divided by 16 times 2 will give us 32 so this is our answer so for the first method for the first, second method the second method you know we can express 9 over 4 to be equals 8 plus 1 divided by 4 which means that we have 8 divided by 4 plus 1 over 4 and we have 2 here we have 2 or oh, let's see 4 divided by 2 will give us 2 then we have 1 over 4 so now this is equals 2 plus 1 over 4 so the above expression the above expression will now become 25 divided by 4 is to power 2 plus 1 over 4 so this is equals we have the law of indices I explained earlier we have raised to power 2 multiplied by 25 divided by 4 raised to power 1 over 4. So here we distribute square to so both 25 and 4. We have 25 square divided by 4 square. So multiply here 25 can be expressed as. 5 raised to power 2 divided by 2 raised to power 2 and we have raised to power 1 over 4 so now we have this raised to power 2 to give us 66 uh, 25 yes divided by 4 square will give us 16 multiply by this and this they have um, square so we can express them as 5 divided by 2 square but remember they are raised to power both of them are raised to power one over four so now we will have six to five divided by sixteen multiply by but look here we have two year one two year two so we have five divided by two raised to power one over two so we have 6 to 5 divided by 16 times this is to power 1 over 2. I said earlier that it is equals square root of 5 divided by 2. So if we distribute this square root to both 5 and 2, we will have 6 to 5 divided by 16 multiplied by square root of 5 divided by square root of 2. So now we will have. 6 to 5 divided by 16 times square root of 5 divided by square root of 2. So we will have here 6 to 5 divided by 16. 6 to 5 root 5 divided by 16 root 2. So like I explained earlier that you have to rationalize it. If you rationalize this, you get your answer to be 625 root 10 divided by 32. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you do, kindly like and leave a comment. And don't forget to share with your friends and network. Do well to also subscribe to my channel to stay updated on my next video. Bye.